the lord choosing his disciples there's a call on your life you are among the chosen if you see that truth and realize that truth it will make all the difference to your daily life that you can see the truth you are among the chosen the do are god's special choice the do are very special to god and very precious to god special and precious ask yourself how do you use, how do you see yourself about the about the fact of who you are where you are which family you were born into which country you you know think of all that fact is and do you see that god has chosen you to be who you are today there's a lovely thought in the bulletin this week a very beautiful one from oliver todd don't talk too much about god don't talk too much about god but live every day in the certainty live every day in the certainty that god has written your name in the palm of his hand and nothing in the world can ever separate you from god's love this is a beautiful thought you don't need to feel warm about god how can you be feel feel warm about somebody you haven't seen that's why faith is not a feeling that's why don't, don't go to church because you feel enthusiastic no no you go to church because you believe in the goodness of god not that you feel up to it every morning feel excited no no forget about excitements and thrills and emotional feelings and feeling high one morning you are high even when you are down what is the point you have to keep that balance don't be driven by emotions but by convictions conviction you are sure i don't feel it but i am convinced this moment i don't feel god loves me but i am convinced i am among the chosen very precious very important him that's why would, otherwise i would not have been born into this world my whole being my my shape my form my address my my color everything god's special choice to think of yours of that way you always rejoice in who you are today there's something in today's psalm that like like not that psalm line first of all the response the lord takes delight in his people the lord takes delight in his people Make it all about rejoicing. Let them praise His name with the dancing. Make a music with the timbrel and harp. Always be joyful. Let the praise of God be on your lips. Let the faithful rejoice in their glory. There is a glory. You know the word glory. So I am going too long. The word glory. What is the meaning of the word glory? Glory means only one thing: weight. the original greek word is glory means weight you carry so much weight the power the goodness of god the mercy of god the wisdom of god the power of so you are carrying the glory of god why you are special because you have got god's glory within you so you let the praise his name with it uh, let us let the faithful rejoice in their glory because your glory is the glory of god so always rejoice in your glory 
glory is from god so what you are who you are where you are what you do everything your vocation everything carries the splendor and the glory of god so rejoice in your glory which is the glory of god